Hey everybody, how's it going? Jonathan here with Automate with Jonathan. Today I'm going to be showing you how to fix specifically this error. The error states session not created exception message session not created. This version of Chrome driver only supports Chrome version and then whatever that version might be. It's like one through 103. It could be any one of those right now, depending on, on which version you have. So if you're getting this error, here's how you fix it. Step number one to fixing this error is to uh, go into Chrome and click about and then click the about Google Chrome tab. And then we're going to check for our version. So we're version 103. And what this code is telling me is that the Chrome version I have installed is eight versions out of date. It's Chrome 95, Chrome version 95. So what we have to do is update that Chrome uh file to be the 103 uh, version 103 so to do that we just go into a google search box and we type in uh, chrome driver download in the google search box and what that'll do is it'll bring you to this page should be the top chrome driver.chromium.org we click that link and then look at these versions here version 103 104 102 all the way down so we were probably we were running this version before and we don't want to use that we want to use 103 so we click 103 opens up this new directory with all these with these these couple of different downloads we're gonna we're using a mac 64 you pick the one that you're using uh, but this is what we're using with mac 64 without the m1 chip mac 64 fantastic that opened up that downloaded a zip file and uh and that zip file uh unzipped it you know let's let's go back here i want to show you how i unzip that this is the latest one there's that zip file let's unzip it see there it is chrome driver and what i'm going to do is i'm just going to uh, open up a new folder window and we'll go over the desktop and we're going to press three buttons the command key, the shift, and the G. This is going to open up a dialog box. That dialog box is going to allow us to navigate to the location of our Chrome driver. We specified the location of our Chrome driver right here. User local bin. So let's go there. User local bin. Slash user slash local dot bin. Click it. And now we're here. Let's make this a little more readable by making it a list. So there's here, here it is, our old Chrome driver in this bin folder. What we want to do is drag this guy over and replace it. So, so now we've updated that file to be the 103 version, which we just downloaded. So this is still not going to run because we have to do one more thing. So let's just click run. Okay. You have to do this. Okay, Chrome driver cannot be open because the developer cannot be verified. Ah, darn it. So once we go through that, we go back into uh, our system preferences, and then you want to go security and privacy. And you see where it says allow app downloaded from. Chrome driver was blocked from use because it's from an unidentified developer. Or it's not from an identified developer. We're going to click allow anyway. And then we're going to rerun our script. And now we'll give us a different prompt. Mac OS S connect to verify the developer. Are you sure you want to uh, open it? And then we click open. Look, it's running now. So that's how you fix that error. Uh, thank you very much for watching. And yep, that all ran. Perfect. Great. So if you got anything out of this video, please click the like button. And uh, thank you for watching. Have a great day. Bye-bye.